Hello my lovelies and welcome to another video. I am so excited to be for the first time this part of the year in such a festive setup. I think it's like the first one of maybe many, maybe not. I'm not sure. You know guys that I'm not a very, very, very festive person. Like I am, okay? But I'm not all about like DIY, decorating, wrapping gifts. It's like probably my worst nightmare or job. Maybe because growing up, my family members will tell me that I'm literally like the worst Christmas gift wrapper. So I don't know what to say about that. They killed the spirit a little bit. They were basically like my Grinches who stole the Christmas. But I love the cozy, festive Christmassy season for so many other reasons. Like one of them definitely being the amount of food and downtime that we get to have at the end of the year. It's just such a beautiful, peaceful time of the year. And that's one thing that really gets me every time. So yeah. Saying that, Vlogmas is starting very, very soon. I know I keep repeating it, but from the 1st of December, you guys will have one video every single day at 8 p.m central european time so i hope you guys will join me for that if you're not a subscriber make sure to subscribe below so you can stay up to date with all of my vlogs coming up because there will be many i promise i mean one a day what more can we do saying that i know that during december there will not be any sit down videos like this one basically i decided to give you some sit down videos now that we know we are kind of in this you know, this type of schedule. So basically in December, it'll be more like vlogging. You guys will see everything that I do every single day, just like always, like every December. But now until we hit 1st of December, I'm kind of zhuzhing up my content a little bit so that you get more sit down videos for the rest of you who really enjoy them. After Vlogmas, there'll be a few sit down videos as well. So we kind of mix it up for everybody to have something that they like. Before I start talking about the topic of today's video, which you guys already know what it is. I just wanted to show you what I'm wearing. I'm wearing this gorgeous cashmere reformation cardigan that I actually shown you in my previous video. I really love it. I opened like the top button and then kind of just like styled up my jewelry game a little bit, which I think is quite cute. I got my Kate jeans. You know what I mean? It's like quite cozy and this is so soft. It's probably like one of the softest knits I actually own. Today's video topic is going to be, as the title says, sort of like styling staple pieces and type of a quiet luxury vibe, but for every every budget. Now, what does quiet luxury even mean? I think like many YouTubers have covered the topic. I think I even spoke about it. There's no need to actually fill you in because by now I'm sure all of you understood that we're heading into like this phase of fashion where everybody wants to dress a little bit more classically in terms of less logo, maybe even less colors, more kind of neutral, beautiful, well-made pieces. And usually people say that with well-made pieces and better quality materials, the price point immediately shoots up as well. And that definitely is the case to an extent. I did literally look high and low around this world to find some of like good high street brands that use really good materials such as wool, silk, cashmere to find pieces that I believe could definitely be staples in your wardrobe for a very long time. And they 100% fall under the quite luxury trend category. I don't think it's necessarily important to follow trends, which is why this particular trend is perfect because it's not trendy. It's more like classical, so it will last forever. If you wear any of these pieces next year or year after or the one after, you most definitely will be covered. Isn't that great news? And on top of that, we all know that we're in the cyber week right now. You guys know that there are huge discounts online. I mean, I don't understand how would you not know. I even written several blog posts on this topic. Make sure to check them out. And I will write also one on the high street picks and favorites that are discounted, which is something that you will see a lot in this video. Now, I don't I like the word high street because very often it also kind of means that the pieces are not the best made. So these brands for me are the brands that I love to wear, especially I have like lots of pieces you guys know from like cost from H&M, etc. And I believe these are really, really great pieces and like sort of an investment pieces, even though they might not necessarily break the bank. So one thing before we start talking about Black Friday discounts, you guys know as well that I believe when it comes to kind of like quite luxury and really this modern styling, I think that it's like good quality materials and pieces that just really are easy to style and mix and match are the key. I also really always love to add a nice watch, nice jewelry. I think like, you know, that if I wear very, very basic cashmere track suit, but I have like a very nice watch, obviously like my engagement ring, few pieces of jewelry that really spice 
it up, that completely changes the game. Nicely styled hair, makeup that is done in a way that is not too much. It's quite clean girl aesthetic. I just think like beautiful jewelry that is kind of like a classic or trendy, whatever you want to give like a bit of extra. Nice pair of shoes and classic clothing is chef's kiss. Now today I'm wearing a bit of every kind of brand, pretty much. Obviously I'm wearing my Admar Piguet Royal Oak Offshore watch, my engagement ring. I'm wearing three beautiful Misoma bracelets that I think are pretty classic. Like for example, the pearl one and the very thin flat snake one could be more like minimal vibe. Whereas if you like more of an extra detail, I like this one in good hands from Harry Street collaboration. They're currently also having a massive discount on Misoma website. So check it out. I will link these below. I will also link my necklaces. I got my Cartier single diamond one that I got from Filippo for our anniversary last year. Then I got a Misoma, this is like a horn one that I've been wearing pretty much, you know, since forever. And my flat snake one that I really love and I wore a million times before. My hoops are actually the very, very new hoops that I got since like recently. These are Monica Vinader hoops. They're quite different to all the other hoops that I have because they're a little bit bigger, but again, not too big. And they're a little bit chunkier. So I think this with also a turtleneck really works because if you can't have any necklaces, quite nice chunkier hoop always works. I mean, you guys know how much I love hoops. I almost feel like I should be the hoop ambassador because I wear so many hoops. The other brand of jewelry that I really love and I think is beautiful for this kind of like a quiet luxury moment is Adele. Now, this is not sponsored. Just like honestly telling you what I've been loving and wearing and enjoying. And I think Adele does such incredible, incredible pieces. Now my sister behind the camera is showing off with her Adele pieces. <laughs> she's showing me that she's wearing them in her ears. I love that they do like sustainable diamonds, beautiful materials, long lasting pieces that are very like dainty, but cute. Some of my favorite pieces are from Adil and they're also having a bit of a promotion this November. So I'll put all of that information in the description box below so you guys can really enjoy your time shopping. Now let's start with some staples that I think are necessary in everybody's wardrobe. First off, let's start with something that you guys always ask me about, t-shirts, okay? Like if I open the balcony now and I shout here in the middle of nowhere and I ask what are my favorite white t-shirts, someone will answer Uniqlo because I've been wearing like Uniqlo t-shirts for the longest time now. I know that Uniqlo often also has a Black Friday promotion and I will include the type of t-shirt that I often wear in the description box below, but I decided to try on something new from Cos and these are a little bit like of a sturdier cotton. I really, really like them, especially for this season. So I got a gray one. Their t-shirts are so beautiful. This one is size S, so size small. As you can see, it's pretty much like true to size, like a little bit, not like too fitted, but this is perfect for under a blazer or under a cardigan. And I also decided to get a white one, which I really already love. Look how cute and clean this is. So like this with a pair of denim and a blazer is my favorite type of look. I also love when a t-shirt like this is worn with a knit, like a heavy chunky knit tied over shoulders. I think that's like such old money aesthetics. Like I hate that saying old money aesthetic, but I think everybody knows what I mean when I say that. So I don't have to overly explain. And good white t-shirt is, I don't know, like just something that is such a good thing to have because I don't know about you, but I have so many t-shirts and some of them look like, I mean, I sleep in that. You know what I mean? I don't go out with them. So there's a huge differentiation between the t-shirts that you wear to sleep in and between those that you want to show up in. And I think like white crisp t-shirt speaks volumes. I got a few pieces at cost because they're actually having like an incredible, incredible promotion right now. So check out for the pieces that I'm going to show you because they are heavily discounted, especially because these are cashmere knits. I think there's nothing more appealing than a brown cashmere knit. And I love the one that I have from Reformation. Am I talking about this Reformation knit for three videos now in a row? I think it's almost like embarrassing. I have like 60 knits, yet I talk about the same one. If you don't know which knit I'm talking about, I will link it in the description box below, but it's really beautiful and it's also a great price and on sale at the moment but I wanted a little bit of a darker vibe right now as you can see I'm really loving digging brown at the moment but this chocolate brown is just so beautiful especially because it's like a classic knit this is also beautiful to be tied around your shoulders and it goes really well with my Uggs that I'm wearing right now as well I love these Uggs I mean they're so good anyway isn't this beautiful look at this I think this is so gorgeous and the fact that it's cashmere and so warm and so soft and so cozy and even warm like that. 
a huge exactly i love it over the shoulders i think this is so beautiful strongly recommend it oh i forgot to tell you that i also got a black t-shirt because actually believe it or not yes i have lots of white t-shirts but i don't have a single black t-shirt and this one looks very cute it's also small it's a little bit cropped and i think it's a different style so i'll also link the black t-shirt below black t-shirt must have right or am i just justifying this purchase but i also have to be honest with you guys i even have some t-shirts from the row and i was placing an order from already for the next winter because i get to actually actually shop at certain brands before they even land in the shops so i was placing my order and i was looking at the t-shirts they look so beautiful but i was like 600 euro for a t-shirt that i mean not even i am that crazy i mean we all know i'm crazy but you know there's also a line that i will put and i just think like this is perfect like classic pieces that i love to have in my wardrobe and that i can like wash 50 times and not worry about the outcome now you will notice that there's not really that much color in this video and it's not because i don't like color because i really love 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 color you guys know that i got recently my adidas hand sneakers i will also link them below because i think they're like an amazing amazing staple and you can get them in like more muted color in like a blue or green or red i really love my green ones i love a bit of color but when it's just like a touch of color and also when it looks really good now i wouldn't spend a ton of money on a pop of color just because when you wear it once when you wear it next time and next time what you want to do when you spend a lot of money on a piece you end up being this person that is like the girl in the orange sweater you know what i mean and sometimes it's okay when i can really justify like a beautiful like catchy dress for like a special event or when it's like a knit i'm not sure i want to look like i'm wearing the same knit over and over and over again now i got this green wool one because it's like a beautiful turtleneck and i thought this would be like a really cute pop of color for the days that i wanted and i also love the color green because it goes so well with brown or does that just look like a tree if i wore brown trousers and a green sweater but i look like a tree no I mean, I really love this green. It's such a beautiful one. I love olive green. I love this green, the grass green. And it's just, I think, like a beautiful, beautiful pop of color when you really need this. And even with like a white shirt poking under, I'm sure you all have a white shirt. White shirt poking under, baggy jeans and sneakers, and you'll be looking gorgeous. Now, I don't think in this video there'll be like a lot of kind of party moments. There'll be few that I think are like quite muted and elegant. I like when, I don't know, maybe I'm maturing as well, but I like when a woman can really speak for herself and the clothing can just look like a plus on top of it. And I think the next look is definitely it. It's a set of a tube top with tiny specks of, I don't know, like shimmer inside, but it's kind of like a lurexy material tube top and a skirt. And the skirt is like a quite fitted maxi-ish or midi, but the set is so beautiful. I think like with a beautiful necklace, or like again beautiful jewelry your hair like a clean girl aesthetics and a nice pair of heels this is just a look that will speak for itself and like you can actually be the woman in a dress and not dress carrying a woman if you know what i mean but it's also funny because like i just told you maybe i'm maturing so i'm more liking pieces like this then i asked some of my 20 year old team members and they were all like telling me that they would have loved to pick this like without knowing that i picked it when i asked them what would you pick they were like we would pick this from the whole selection of the website i was like wow so i'll link this as well below because i think it's a beautiful beautiful selection for a nice dinner date but also for an office party which is great so obviously we have festive season around the corner and if you need something that looks like really chic but doesn't break a bank check this out now I just told you that I really love to buy good quality pieces that are not too expensive, so especially when it comes to socks. I love a few different brands, like I love Falke, I love Wolford, but I'm not the one really necessarily buying socks when like one pair is 120 pounds, which does exist. I know you'll be surprised, but I like when things and socks are well made. And I'm so happy that I can finally show you this because I've been wanting to wear it for the past 24 hours, but I was like, I need to show it. Show first, wear it later. Look how beautiful are these cashmere socks. Now I got some cashmere socks from Cos last season and i have to be very honest i wore them so much i even worn them in my last videos that you guys have seen now i got the cashmere set i also have a cashmere set from last year there are like two pairs of socks in here and these will go very well also with my uggs but i also got a wool set they're like three pairs and i think they're so beautiful and so cozy but in browns because i'm really into brown this season and then i also got some in the men's section these are like you know like those kind of like thin men's socks that men normally wear i think with like work shoes and they just feel so 
luscious, but the best part about this is that I want to wear them with like loafers, like, you know, my Hermes or Chanel or whatever loafers Prada. And you know, when you're like looking for that perfect, like thinner material sock, I don't know if you know, but like, I wouldn't wear these socks with my sneakers, for example, but her, they're perfect, perfect, perfect for loafers. So I really wanted something like this. And you guys always ask me where I get my socks. So I actually really like Arkit and Cause socks. Is that weird? I don't know. Now I have two beautiful kind of like sets as well that I don't want to necessarily call suits because I think they're more of like along the lines of sets. And the first one that I'm really obsessed with is this brown one. It feels so gorgeous, but when you see it on with the matching jacket, what's also good about this? Look at this. So if you pack this, you have one look, like a brown look together, but then you can wear the jacket separate. You can wear the trousers separate. I love this kind of like herringbone, fishbone type of material. It's like really padded and warm inside, but not too warm. So you can also wear it under a coat and I got size 36. I think everything's in size 36. I love brown. Have I said it already a million times? And just imagine this with like a white t-shirt that I've shown you and then the jacket and also a brown cashmere knit tied over the shoulders and my green sneakers. How cute. I think that would be really, really cute because I'm loving sets like this. I think they're just like such good kind of muted but chic pieces to have. I also had my fair share of navy obsession this year, especially after I got in January my Hermes cargo bag and I love wearing everything navy. So I also got a pair of trousers. These look really flattering and beautiful in navy color. They're a little bit on a thinner side. So maybe if you live in like soft, Dubai, Miami, you know, like anywhere where it's sunny and beautiful. I'm so jealous, but there you would probably be more likely to wear pieces like this because they're more thin. And like, for example, the navy trousers and a white t-shirt are for me a winning combo, 100%. I'm really obsessed with navy. Like I would actually like to get a watch with like a navy dial or something like that because I really love navy so much. I think it's such a smart chic. Maybe I should put on my vision board for 2024, like a steel watch navy dial. Love it. Anyway, another set that I got is this because I absolutely fell in love when I saw it on the model on the website. I was just like, yes, please. Again, slightly thinner material comparing to the brown set. But again, let's pretend I did this for you guys because I actually want you guys as well from all around the world to be covered. I also did it secretly for me because I really love this. When I saw it on, I thought it looked beautiful. Very, very nice kind of color, sort of like a light gray, not too cold. Also would go really well in my new Kelly. Love it. Can't say anything much but that. Really love it. Like two button cropped blazer that can be worn open or closed. You're sorted. Not so difficult to style, especially when you have a set. When you have a set, you don't have to think about anything. You know, it's all been done for you. Now there is something that I think we have to mention in this video because it's timeless. I've mentioned it every single November in a row for like a good five, six years, which means that it's timeless, but it's also on a very good discount. I believe 30% off we have a black leather shirling jacket from all saints now this is so soft but i also think this kind of piece is something that i know that everybody wants at one point of their life in their wardrobe and i personally love this because it's just so easy to wear when you don't want to wear like full length coat but you want to wear something like this along this line and this one is in full black i have it i believe in like light brown with white shirling i have it in many different colors i had a white and black combination but never black on black which i think is again very chic and very sort of i don't know if i would call it like wide luxury but it's like more muted than a typical shirling jacket and i thought this one is obviously probably like one of the most expensive pieces of this video but it's like leather and shirling very high quality made and currently on 30 percent there's a ton of leather jackets that i'm gonna link below some best of the best leather jackets from all saints as well for you guys to check out because i genuinely think when it comes to shirling aviator jackets they're really the best and also who would i be if i was telling you that you know it's all about being classy and having classic pieces, but not mention a classic full length, double breast black coat. I love also the brown one from the previous video that I've shown you very much. And that one is also on sale. And it's like this price is of that one is almost high street. I mean, the price is probably high street price and the quality is great, but I just think that like the black and the brown coat in like full length is obviously you can pick the color you want, maybe even a gray, you know, but those are the kind of coats that just they like speak in some kind of sophistication. Like they, they, they tell the story for itself. It's beautiful. And the best part about them is you can put them on over a pajama and no one's going to know because they look so chic. 
Can we agree on that? I think a good coat is quite important to have. It's also a matter of having like a nice pair of boots or a good pajama. I don't know when's really gonna see you in a good pajama, but I've been speaking about pajamas a long time. I just think like the nice silk pajama is really, really the ultimate luxury. Like it's to sleep in a silk pajama for me is like my favorite thing or on a silk pillowcase. That's really beautiful, which actually reminds me of Lily Silk. Uh, they have really incredible silk pillowcases, pajamas, and also also, something that I would like to definitely highlight that I've been wearing non-stop lately is the cashmere set. Do you guys remember that like beigey color cashmere set? I'm pretty sure they're having like incredible Black Friday sales as well at the moment. So I'll link them below my cashmere set because that cashmere set, I will recommend you like wholeheartedly get the cashmere set it's incredible and talking about cashmere set i've also ordered another one which unfortunately hasn't arrived yet it is so good it's a gray cause cashmere set i will link it below so you know exactly the one that i'm talking about it's going to be my travel look or also like my probably like comfy home look throughout vlogmas i'm smirking because it's actually embarrassing because those kind of sets when i have one i just wear it over and over and over and over and over and over again and it's almost like a little bit embarrassing i remember one year I had this, I think during pandemic, I had a gray one from Arquette. I wore it so much. You guys for sure know what I'm talking about because I wore it so much. It was like a turtleneck and like cashmere trousers. Let's just say that when I wear it, like my friends were like, oh, do you have anything else to wear? I mean, they didn't say, but I'm sure they were thinking it. You know what I mean? Like it's impossible to think that they, they wouldn't be thinking that because it was facts, all facts. Let's continue. Now there are days like today that I definitely don't want to leave the house and it's totally okay if you don't have to leave your house you're lucky and go for it you know what I mean but there are also days that it's raining but I want to go for a hike like with my friends or if I'm sure many of you have dogs like you I'm a little bit envious of that but when I go to my sister's house I also have a dog and I love walking my little fluffy dog so much because you just see his like tail wiggle 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 and then he gets all dirty and then when we come back home I wash his paws like it's just like the best the most rewarding time ever but for those kind of little adventures let's just call them that way I would normally wear like leggings rubber boots and a puffer jacket because a it's often very windy like so windy when I'm walking outfit that my ears would get cold inside you know that feeling I need like something with a hoodie and I need a hat and I want to be like aerodynamic if I need to run <laughs> so I like to wear like a puffer coat now there's so many that I saw online also designer ones I don't know if we even discussed that like in my previous video like there was one from Rick Owens that I saw on sale that is like so good but anyway this one I really love because I've had a similar one for two years now that I've worn for those kind of casual situations I'll insert the picture maybe some of you remember it but now I decided to get like basically the same because I love that one so much in just like a darker more muted color this one actually looks quite chic because of the more muted color and I love this color it's almost green or brown or black it's not really quite cocky but it's something like that and I love the fit of this jacket guys this is the best fit for a puffer jacket that I've experienced honestly it's incredible what I love about it is that it's kind of oversized it's like feels like such a good quality jacket for the price point that you would not believe it so check the link below really really love it it has a really nice spacious as well hoodie on that isn't flimsy and falls if it's windy so for those kind of activities or like any kind of I don't feel like going out days you want to put this on I wouldn't want to with my like aviator jacket or a coat if I'm going out with a dog because if you have to like bend down you don't want your coat going into mud and puddles you know like this is something that is a perfect length warm enough cozy and you feel like you're still in your duvet I know I told you that there are not many kind of like party festive pieces in this video and that's correct I don't know what to tell you it is what it is like I'm kind of completely biased you guys know how much I love Magda Butrum for my festive season and I don't want to show you stuff that I wouldn't wear personally so that is it on the good note though if you are interested Magda Butrum does have incredible sales that I have linked on my blog here just like telling you to definitely go and check out my blog because I promise you the amount of sales and incredible discounts that you will see there both for high street and for designer like you will be mind blown and you will be very happy to see that so definitely check it out like it doesn't cost you anything you can just like window shop if you want but it's really incredible I saw this top which was like priced incredibly let me just put it nicely so you can 
see it. Look at this. Incredible price. This like lovely kind of like a silky drape top with this necklace that actually looks like, to be honest, like something that Brunello Cucinelli would make. I love this is so sparkly, but it looks really chic, really expensive, kind of like those AI made quiet luxury with a glass of champagne type of beautiful hair the girls would wear, right? I would wear this like with either a maxi skirt or with a pair of trousers, like pair of white trousers or jeans. Like I'm not sure what I'm going to style it with. Maybe with the navy trousers that I've shown you because I haven't got like unlimited amount of options here with me, but I really wanted to show you this top because I genuinely think it's so incredible. I think it's really, truly incredible. And the price, when you see this, you will not believe it. Okay. But it's beautiful viscose top with like slightly open back. I love it. It's a winning top. Something that when you guys see, you will be like, well, this is 100% Tamara because I have like a ton of things like this in my wardrobe. And to be honest, they feel pretty much the same, but this is like a fraction of the price. These kind of corsets. How many of these do I have in my wardrobe? Like I have seven, eight. I think so. I have like denim, black, gray, beige. And honestly, when I saw this one, I really loved the front of it, which is like this kind of, it doesn't have like cleavage. It's not like too booby, but it's just like so beautiful and looks flattering. Also, it has like silicone lining inside, so it doesn't slide, which is very, very nice. And I love it. I also love that it has a zip at the back, so you don't have to be doing one by one button because that can be so off-putting when you're dressing up fast. Really love this under blazer and the jeans. And it's like a perfect look if you ask me. So I've told you that I really like the brown coat from my previous video, which is kind of like a straight line long coat that has like million buttons in the front. I love that coat. It's beautiful. It's like straight line silhouette. But I would be lying if I wouldn't tell you that I also love cocoony coats for winter. And I don't really have that many. I really don't, honestly. So I saw this wool blend one. I haven't tried it on yet. I saw this on H&M. I will link the exact one below because I know they have quite a few different brown coats. And I really love the fit. We're going to have to see together how it fits because I haven't tried it on yet. But it's like like a classic single button cocoon coat. It says it's handmade, but that's really nice. And it's like a wool blend brown, chocolate brown coat that goes really well with my Uggs. Whew, that was a bit of a mission. I don't even have to tell you how I'd wear this. You just throw it on pretty much any outfit with my Birkin in gold. That kind of combo for me is just always, and it's very timeless. I mean, this kind of coat will never go out of style. So we're almost coming to the end of this video, which means that I would like to ask you few questions. Did you enjoy this type of video? I've been getting lots of comments that you guys really enjoy my luxury hauls and things like that, but you want to see the things that are a little bit more affordable, but that I will also wear and would wear and will enjoy. And genuinely, I really tried to find pieces that I believe are timeless and I really loved. So I want to hear your opinion as well. What do you like to see? What do you prefer? Do you have any feedback for me? Because that could help me like also always provide the content that you guys want to see. That's my little feedback as well. Now, something that I have very similar in my wardrobe. So I thought you guys might enjoy, especially because what I have is sold out. You guys know that I very often wear my gray manuri trousers with a gray cropped acne blazer. Somehow I found like a perfect match blazer and trousers that are like in same identical print and color. I don't know how that's possible, but it happened. And I think I wore them recently as well. One of my recent videos as well, but I found pretty much same set online. Now I'm not going to take credit for this, but I do feel like this brand has seen that I've worn it a lot and decided to reduce the same. No, I'm just kidding. I'm sure this, they don't even know who I am. But anyway, I wear this set a lot and I decided to get another one because it's slightly a little bit different. Now, these trousers are like gray pinstripe trousers, wool, beautiful, straight leg, ideal for office or office party. You know what I mean? When you can just like style them with like sneakers also and like look amazing. And there's also like a same kind of vibe cropped blazer, like literally same as that look that I wear all the time. Love it. Obviously, there are like three sets in this style, like crop blazer and trousers in this video, because I strongly believe that this is great. And this is also, I, I think if I can remember well on discount at the moment, so I'd snatch it if I was you. Can someone just insert the number of times that I said in this video that I love brown and that I'm just like buying everything brown and I'm obsessed with brown? Or maybe don't because I'll feel really bad, but definitely do not take any shots when you hear me say brown in this video, because I like you guys so work. I got two things that I wanted to show you. This actually 
actually already worn this morning to the breakfast because it's so cozy. It's like a small. And it's this like a turtle neck cashmere dress that, oh my God, I love something like this with the brown coat. I even have brown boots. I have like so many brown things that I can wear with this. Now I'm like turning into this chocolate brown color loving person. And this will be perfect as well for me during Vlogmas when I just want to be cozy, but look cute at home. You know, like some days I just don't want to look like a slob, but I want to be comfy. So I like to wear a cashmere dress, which is why I got another cashmere dress. And this one is, I think my favorite brown shade because it's like very warm, almost with like touch touch of red okay i also love burgundy a lot but just brown has stolen my heart somehow this winter and this one is like a cable knit beautiful long dress i'm gonna wear this one tomorrow morning long sleeves chunky a little bit heavier than the previous one not a turtleneck so you can even style it like you know however you want with uggs if you want really because it's so long cute maxi and versatile love pieces like this also it reminds me so much of my mom my mom at the beginning of the 90s wore all these like cable knit like knits and like i remember in kindergarten when i had to like uh, draw a picture of my mom we had to bring a picture of our mom to kindergarten i brought a picture of my mom with the short red hair in a cable knit sweater yeah, reminds me always of her. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I would love to hear what was your favorite item. Is there anything from this selection that you like to buy? I have to say that I'm shopping a lot to this Black Friday because I'm loving the discounts. Can't blame me, right? And there are like a few things that I would recommend as well at the end of this video for you guys to get that I really loved recently. One of them is the shower head that I recommended recently. And that is so ridiculous. Like, hold on, hold on, hold on. Like, don't judge. But do you remember I told you guys in one of my previous videos that if you just buy one thing, buy this shower head. The best discovery for me of this whole entire month that if you could just buy one thing from this whole haul that I really recommend. Guys, I bought this and I love it so much. It's a shower head. I really stand by my words. I want to hear if any of you guys already got the shower head and if you're showering with this shower head because it's life-changing. The stream of water that comes, it's so perfect. I've never had a shower head like that in my life. And keep in mind, I stay at these beautiful hotels that have really incredible showers. But this is another experience. Plus, it makes the hard water softer, which is great for skin and hair, to have like glossy hair, to have beautiful skin. I have noticed the difference. Um, you can also buy, I will link below the shower head because I think like that shower head, I just, I really love. And it, you can also buy a filter. I will also link the filter that you can buy. I have a filter, but I haven't installed it yet because I need to call a guy to help me install it because my shower is a bit like complicated. So I need to do that because in Italy, the water is so hard and I really need it for my hair to be softer. I will link below some of my favorite Olaplex sets. I think now is like a good time to get them if you want to get them discounted because why not? I also will link Revita Lash. I use a Revita Brow and Revita Lash for my lashes. Like look how long are my lashes. Can you see this? Is it in focus? I hope so. I don't know. I, don't, I can't see. But my lashes are really long thanks to the Revita Lash Serum that I use. And I think like if you can make the most out of it and get it discounted, you should do that now because it's really, really great. At the moment, the lipstick that I'm wearing and I'm getting a lot of compliments on is the Rosy Ink Now. We'll link it below as well where you guys can find it. I love it so much. The other one that I wear all the time as well is my Charlotte Tilbury. One, if you can find those, so I know the Charlotte Tilbury always has great Black Friday offers and I'll find the best ones. I'll put them on my blog so you can check those out. But in general, what I'm really buying this Black Friday is mainly like face and hair masks. So I'm stocking up on my castor oil, on my Olaplex, like I told you guys. I also like my, there's like a Sisley incredible hair mask that I love using. You will be able to find all of those on my blog. And besides that, I love also Tata Harper oh, resurfacing mask. There's like a lot of masks that I will as well link on the blog. So you guys can go and check out the things that I'm stocking up on for the festive season and period. I love my Hourglass also palette. I buy one every November. Currently, my face is basically the snake palette, which now is perfect color for me because I'm a little bit tan. But I think once the tan fades away, I will be using one that is like tiger. You know, the tiger one that I have as well. I'll link them both below so you guys can check them out. But I love them. They're like 10 out of 10 through and through. So yeah, there's a lot of like home stuff as well, party stuff, accessories. I have done a gift guide blog on my blog post so you guys can check it out. And it's kind of also like all budgets as well. We're loving at the moment the H&M home section. I bought like a huge vase <laughs> like Friday sale. So I can't really bring it here. And I also bought some like long candles that are like kind of like twirly. I really like them. Hopefully you guys will find something as well that you're looking for and you'll get some great deals. Really hope so. I hope you enjoyed this video as well. 
well. And I'll see you in my next one. And brace down for Vlogmas. Love you. Bye.